Anyway, enough about that. Virginia City, do they have a uh, homage to uh, Bonanza there? Uh, the yeah, Ponderosa. there's all kinds of stuff there, but you know, uh, the Ponte Rosa is a little bit far from. Uh, oh, I thought it was Virginia City. Do you want me to get into this? Virginia no, let me City? do the wine thing oh, okay. real quick. Um, cool. So this is. It, many of you know I'm the wine writer for the l couple of. Yeah, local you are. Papers. Yeah. yeah. So, are you uppity? No, no, you're not no, uppity. No. Okay. No. I just thought uh, I brought you James Naraki wanted me to ask. Oh, okay. So, you know, well. if you're uppity. Yeah, so so yeah. I um, wanted to. Uh, Get, oh, wine over here. Oh, there he is. Okay, okay. It's called Custard Wine. It's from the north coast of Napa Valley. It's a Chardonnay. Mm -hmm. uh, the, the grapes are all sourced from the area of Napa Valley uh, and the north coast, as they call it. And the fun thing about Chardonnay is it's the number one grape crop in the in California. The, the agricultural um, digest it had it printed that they said over 100,000 acres of farmland are dedicated to the Chardonnay. Mm -hmm. Cabernet is number two, but Chardonnay is number one. So this particular uh, Chardonnay is called custard. So what do you think it's going to taste like? Oh, custard, of course. Well, let's see. Let's, let's find see. out. All yeah. Right. So I brought it here. Uh, you know, a lot of people, when they're talking about Chardonnays, they say it either is buttery, yeah. crisp, or uh, dry. Mm. You and know, my good friend Stuart Johnson loves cupcake. You've heard of that okay. wine? It does taste nothing like cupcake, I'll tell you that right well, now. Well, this one's you know? called Custard, and I got this one at Vons, but ah. you can get them at any uh, local retailer. Oh. It's about 15 bucks okay. a, a bottle. Yeah, okay. So let's just start just, you off there oh, okay. and get me a little bit there. Okay. And I like my Chardonnay just chilled. Some okay. people put it in the freezer for too long. I like it just below custard. room temperature. Okay. So this one's called Custard Chardonnay. Cheers. 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 All right. Yep. So, and I want your honest opinion. Not bad. Good. Yeah, not bad. So what does it taste like? Does it taste like, does it taste like custard? <laughs> what are you thinking? Well, it doesn't taste like butter. Do you remember, remember back in the day when it had Thunderbird and Ripple and all that kind of you stuff? You do. You don't remember any no, of that I mean, stuff? I, yeah, I yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been with you for 10 yeah. years. I remember. Mad I know Dog all, 2020. I know all the jokes. Mad Dog 2020. Uh -huh. Well, this is nothing like it. This is okay. very top notch. All right, good. Very good stuff. So we'll share yeah. this with the crew as soon as the show's over. But oh, I just oh. wanted to. Uh, we're, not, we're not sharing anything with the crew. That's a, oh, we're going to drink that right on after we're done with these mojitos. No, no, no not in there. But, yeah, no, all right, so good. that's custard chardonnay, and uh, it's my pick of the week. And you can go over to Vons pick, or Pavilion. Pick of the week, okay. Pick of the week. It's 15 bucks, and that's about the right price you want to spend on chardonnay.